Hi, I'm Sunita Coleman and I am the Head of Recruitment here at E2W. Um, take some time to introduce myself and just tell you a little bit about what it's like working with E2W. Um, the one word I would definitely use to describe is fulfilling. Um, I've done recruitment for a number of years now and I have really enjoyed the fact that I've been able to help people. Um, but this is the first time I've been able to sort of amalgamate my passion with recruitment and I have a real and have always had a real passion for diversity and inclusion. And so being able to be part of an organisation that allows me to do the two is just great. And I really do find my role a lot more fulfilling now. I also find, you know, it's a very flexible working environment, a very empathetic working environment. I think, you know, Mark and Tina, who own the organisation, are, you know, trying to spread a message and, and change the way, you know, women are treated in the workplace and they lead by example. Um, I have no issues with having to finish early to go pick up my son or, you know, work hours around his education or anything like that. And it's just nice to feel like in an environment where I'm not pressurised or penalised for being a working mum. The next question is, what aspects of memberships do you enjoy and why? Um, I would have to say like the community that it has built and we use the word community a lot and when I first started I thought, you know, why? But now I really do see why we do. Um, everyone sort of works together, supports each other. Um, there's no real hidden agendas. Everyone just really wants to help everyone. Um, and so for me, I just love being around this community and learning from them and being able to also give my, um, you know, anything that I can sort of help them with or support them with on the recruitment side and things like that. And it's just, you know, developing these professional relationships, um, but also, pro you know, these personal relationships with like-minded women. What have I learnt? Um... I would say I have always been aware of the gender pay gap um, and, you know, and been aware of like, you know, the DNI side of things. But I don't think I really fully understood or covered all areas of DNI. So for me, it's really opened my eyes to not just, you know, gender diversity and also ethnicity, but also, you know, looking at neurodiversity, uh, socioeconomic diversity. Um, there's so many other areas and underrepresented areas that I feel like I really want to get more involved with and, and have grown my passion for. How would you describe E2W slash Men for Inclusion to prospective member? Um, I feel like it's just an organisation that can fully educate you on everything to do with having a diverse workforce. Um, not only do we focus on guiding you, but we also want to help change your organisation, change your thought process and, and just make it a better working environment for so many. Men for Inclusion, I think, is great. Getting more men involved. Um, I heard someone say not too long ago, there's no point preaching to the converted. And so, you know, I can sit here and talk for hours about the gender pay gap and, and you know, equality with women to other women. But hopefully we're already on the same side. And so getting more men involved with that just makes sense. Um, in order to make the change, we need everyone to be involved. I am the head of recruitment here at E2W. I've been working recruitment now for just over 10 years and I focused on you know finance regulatory affairs and so on um I really came to a crossroad in my career in um you know sort of end of 2020 early 2021 um where I just realized I wanted to be more fulfilled by my role um and that's when the opportunity at E2W came about and I was really able to align my passion for diversity and inclusion with you know my expertise in recruitment um and I've just really thoroughly enjoyed making a difference side of work I'm a mother to a three-year-old very energetic boy um, and so my life is pretty much consumed with Marvel superheroes football and play-doh <laughs>